talking to the stars of Thor, Chris Hemsworth and Natalie Portman. But first, he's in a league of his own. It's Mr. James Corden! <laughs> oh, oh. Did this, this, this is great. Right. Big hugging. Hello. Very nice to see you, sir. Come in, sit down, sit down. Get ready to roar! It's Katy Perry! Oh! Welcome back. So nice to see you, darling. Have a seat, have a seat, girl. And it's going to be a night to remember. It is Sir Paul McCartney! Oh, I'm loving this couch. Uh, now, you guys all know each other, don't you? Oh, yeah, we hung out backstage. Oh, yeah, we're never you know, not. We're, we're rarely Whatever. apart. <laughs> no, <we're laughs> apart. Yeah. But, no, but, Katie, you, you've sung Paul's songs, haven't you? I sang Hey Jude at a benefit uh, called Music Cares that was honouring him. Oh. Yes, it was very nice. Good. I sang all of I sing all of his songs. I've sang them all my life. So I'm like, I'm sitting next to him. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> well, actually, but you I'm were sitting next to Katie. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm right here. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> You, you return the favour with Katie's songs, don't you? In the, you were telling me that you and well, your daughter... Well, yeah, I have a ten-year-old daughter and we love... Fire! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's a good song. It, it's a fantastic song. It. And uh, here's the other odd thing about our sofa tonight. Two pop stars, James Corden, and yet they all have had a number one single. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, Katie Perry, how many of you had? You've had ten? Ten here? Uh, yeah. Eight here? I, I, a yeah. bunch, anyway. Yeah. You've handful, had a lot. A handful, yes. Uh, James, the... One. <laughs> it was one, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Let's not get carried away. It was, it was a terrible song for charity. <laughs> you give too I much, don't James. don't ever stop, Katie. <laughs> that's the truth. So yeah. you've had one. You've had... Now, Paul McCartney, uh, do you want to guess? Have a guess, Katie and James. How many number well, ones is it? Which, which albums are we counting here? Which uh, like is singles? Solo, are we talking singles? All solo, right? It num yes, no, it be, yeah, no, not albums, total, single, this is single, number one right. single. I think f 55. I think 42. Okay, it's disappointing now. It's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's, yeah. it's going to be, yeah. Okay, try again try lower, yeah, lower. Yeah, try again okay. lower, oh. it'll be good. Yeah, yeah. Well, I thought he had 10 and I've only been going for like five years. <laughs> <laughs> I've had one, I'm not even a singer. Really <laughs> <laughs> it's it's not difficult, thing. Graham, that's what we're trying to get across. Um, exactly. I Graham, think... is it more than ten? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I, I think, uh, twenty-one. Oh, that's a good guess. Twenty? Uh, I, twenty-four. Yes! <laughs> oh, it is twenty-four! <laughs> but, but this is, this is the kicker, though. So, twenty-four singles, but he has spent... 98 weeks at number one. Oh, wow. 98 with two years <laughs> at number one. That was a long time. Right? But, you know, I love that song, Ram On. You, you know? do? It's one of my favorite songs of yours that you've ever done. Well, thank you, it's Katie. Beautiful. It's a very little song. I know. It's so, it's like a, it sounds like a ukulele. It is a ukulele, it's yeah. so sweet. I listen to it oh. with my boyfriend all the time. We love it. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> we do you. enjoy it when we listen to it together. <laughs> <laughs> so much has happened backstage. <laughs> uh, so listen, uh, the, the stars of Thor, they're going to be uh, joining us later. But uh, really, a lot of music to talk about. Uh, Katie's got your new album, uh, Prism. It's out now. James's new film about the singer Paul Potts, One Chance. But we will begin with Paul's new album, New. Uh, yes, uh, it's out now. Well, that's the thing. This is your 16th solo album, but the response to this has been phenomenal. The reviews are brilliant. You must be thrilled. Yeah, it really has, yeah, it's amazing. I mean, you know, when you're releasing a new album like this, you kind of hold your breath and don't say anything too soon. But it is really starting to get a lot of uh, very good feedback. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think, like, when you were writing these, these songs, mm. did you... Because you're in a very happy place, you're all loved up, it's all good in your life. Do you think that that's the reason why it's a really good album? I, I think it helps. Yeah, I mean, uh, I, had a, I had a thing when I was writing this 
Um, Nancy would be, in our early days, she would be in New York, five hours back. So I would drop my little girl, the uh, fireworks fan, <laughs> um, <laughs> off at school, and I'd come home, and I'd have a few hours where I didn't have anything on. So I would write a song, and then I'd ring her. Good morning. Would you like to hear a song? She said, no. <laughs> <laughs> but um, no, so she would say, yeah, so I would play her the song. So it became a really great motivation. Well, and have you ever had writer's block? Because reading about you, it sounds like you've always found the process of songwriting easy. You know, I mean, I, I've really been amazingly lucky. And um, I was looking at the other day at all the songs that John and I wrote together. It's like nearly 300. And, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> showing off here <laughs> but um, I, I remembered that I would go out to his house or he'd come to mine and we would sit down for approximately three hours and try and write a song and I realized we never came away without a song wow, wow. we we got very close one day because I brought in a song called golden rings and it was uh, uh, I can buy you golden rings and stuff and we were it was like oh god and we couldn't get anywhere with this thing so then we had a cup of tea, came back to it, and I said, you know, we should, like, change it, we should drive my car or something. So we changed oh, instead oh. of... <laughs> <laughs> we know that one. <laughs> <laughs> so that was... We nearly got unlucky with that, but luckily we had the cup of tea and what was in the tea. And uh, do you know... <laughs> Sure, uh, sure. Yeah, yeah. It, yeah. Was, it, was a, it was the tea that did it. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> Drink a whole pot. <laughs> pot. Yeah. <laughs> so, so you did three hundred with John. Uh, do you ever write a song and kind of think, "Oh, that's good," and then kind of think, "Actually, have I written that song before?" Because. <laughs> yeah, you do. Um, yeah, you. So you have to just sort of check it out with people. You know, you you, you get a antenna. You know, you know. Have you heard this song before? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you wrote it. <laughs> James down the end there. Uh, the last time you were here, you told us about your your boy band beginnings, and no, and no, <laughs> no, and they didn't do covers. They didn't do covers. Oh, you sang, on. you sang your own. Oh, you can't, you did. can't. You wrote me. songs. Oh, Come shut up! You wrote me. songs. <laughs> you can't, you cannot make a genuine <laughs> leap from the Paul McCartney games where you're talking about their songwriting, going, and of course your boy band days. <laughs> Ridiculous! <laughs> it's very sweet. Have you given up the songwriting? <laughs> what are you it's a gift. About? <laughs> it's a gift, James. <laughs> you shouldn't walk away from that. <laughs> you should. <laughs> so bad. And we had songs like "Girl, Are You Ready?" and <laughs> "Time Can't Stop Us Now." And and, uh, <laughs> and then Next a big album. song actually that, that about these golden rings, <laughs> but we just couldn't find a way <laughs> to put it. <laughs> yeah, but when when it comes to writing songs, that that process you say, like ringing up Nancy and saying, "Do you want to hear a song?" Like that must be the nicest feeling in the world, having someone, particularly Paul McCartney, uh, like write you a song because. You have used lots of names. You know, there's uh, <laughs> Michelle, Eleanor, Jude, Lizzie, Sadie. Over the... And I guess some names are better for songs than others. Mm. We've got three creative minds on the sofa. All songwriters. I don't care what you say. All <laughs> songwriters. <laughs> this is so All ridiculous. All songwriters. <laughs> so, uh, I want to chat... Does anyone in the audience think they have a name that they can't think of a, a rhyme for? Obviously, everyone in the audience has a name. Lady putting her hand up. Anyone, <laughs> yeah. Does anyone have a name? <laughs> yes! No, has anyone got a name you think... Oh, that was oh, lady over there in the corner. Uh, can, we, can we get the boom all the way there? What, what's your name? Shishimiso. Oh, now... Oh. <laughs> Tell us again. Shishimiso. Shishimiso? Yeah. Uh, what? Do you, do you, do you want to share a miso? <laughs> you should be so lucky. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Shishimiso, you should be so lucky to come with me and share a miso. <laughs> Good. See? Yeah.
Wow. Yeah. You are so nice. Yeah. Should we try another one? Let's try another one. Any, anyone, anyone else? Anyone else? Oh, there's a, a lady, a lady there with her hand up by the wall. The wall. Summer. Oh. Summer. A bit of a bummer. <laughs> Problem and dumber. Oh, yeah, dumb. <laughs> yes. Yeah, um, come yeah, on, James. Yeah, Summer, we would listen to Joe Strummer, <laughs> but I had to leave her because she wouldn't let me bummer. Now, Paul, Paul, Katie, do you want a pen? Do you want a pen? To write? You, you can write some of these guys, ideas you, now. You yeah, should harness this stuff, guys. It's all going in here. This is, this is, yeah. is gold. Do it between it. Sir Paul McCartney and Katy Perry. Bummer. <laughs> no. OK, one last one. Let's do one last one. Uh, there's a, a lady there with a short... Oh, actually, let's do the glittery lady. <laughs> yeah. uh, Lorna Jean? No, let's not do that. <laughs> uh, lady with short blonde hair, the glasses. So they get through all there. Ulla. Oh, oh, it's a good one. What? What is it? Ulla. Ula. Ula. Where, where are you from? Uh, Finland. From Finland. Ula from Finland. Ula. Ula. <laughs> come on, James. What did you say? Come, come on, on, James. Don't in my lyrics. Ula. No. Ula. Ula. Come on, come on, guys. Focus. You couldn't fool her. <gasps> Excellent. Yeah. You fool her. <laughs> She's much taller. <laughs> and plastic Ula. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh. You missed that. Ula, you couldn't fool her because she's cooler than a plastic ruler. Oh. <laughs> well done, all the great advice. Thank you. Very good. Okay.